Uh, more often than not, we get referee letters uh, from folks who really don't know the applicant, you know? Um, and they, they kind of say, this person was in my class and they were in the top two thirds. And, you know, and then they kind of do a boilerplate uh, reference letter. Um, we essentially discard those. Uh, so the, the business of getting a good reference letter starts long before you want to apply to graduate school. Uh, you need reference letters for jobs, whether you want to go to graduate school or not. You need reference letters once you finish graduate, finish your undergraduate degrees or graduate degrees. So you better form good, positive relationships with your professors long before that time, so that when they write about you, they write about you, not a boilerplate about a student who happened to be in one of their classes. And so uh, I think it's very, very important to to get the reference letter from a person who knows you uh, rather than the person that you approach at the end of a semester and say, hey, prof, I got an A minus in your class. Uh, why don't you write me a reference? 